consistent queen back again with another video i mean as you guys know we are consistent if you're new here thank you for stopping by please don't forget to hit that subscribe button trust me you're gonna love it here and if you're a returning subscriber then thank you so so much for coming back so as you guys can tell from the title of this video today's girl talk video is going to be all things self worth so if you're interested please do stick around and don't forget to like this video and i hope that you enjoy it so to me personally self-love is an umbrella it's an umbrella for things like self-confidence self-acceptance self-esteem self-worth self-trust and most importantly self-belief so you can't really have self-belief or self-trust or even self-acceptance if you don't have self-love everything starts with self-love the older that i become the more i realize that in order to live a life that i really love the life that i want i need to be achieving my goals you know i need to be achieving the things that i've set out for myself but the thing is with life if you don't like take action towards something you won't achieve anything <laughs> so you won't have the life that you love and the life that you want to live if you're not like actively taking steps towards it but the thing is the thing is you won't be able to take those steps towards like the stuff that you want if you don't have self-confidence and if you don't believe like if you don't inherently believe that you know what you can do this like it all starts with you like really believing in yourself because without self-belief like if you just think that you're whack trust me you're going to be whack okay actions equals results it's a very simple formula guys and i'm a math person so i love formulas actions equal results but you won't be able to take that action without inherently believing that you know what this is something that i deserve this is something that i can do and without having that self-motivation your actions are truly limited to how you see yourself and what you believe that you're capable of so guys if you feel like you're unworthy you're going to subconsciously act unworthy like throughout every aspect of your life if you inherently believe that you're unworthy trust me your things will just not be adding up and you'll sit down and wonder like oh my goodness why are my things not adding up why is this and this happening and it's because inherently you don't believe that you deserve those things whereas if you really do believe that you know i'd like i'm that girl i deserve i deserve a soft life i deserve soft things you know a fine girl deserves fine things you will automatically be a go-getter because you will inherently believe that you know what like these are the things that i deserve i know what i'm supposed to do let me go do it and with me personally guys like obviously everything that i'm saying in this video is like from my own personal experience because i really went through a period where yo guys my self-love was just not it was just not in check and in turn that really affected like my self-confidence and my self-belief and thing is when your self-belief is like affected and you really don't believe in yourself you're going to end up just like going with the flow you're just not going to be you know and i just felt like a lot of the time i was like moving without direction like i was moving for sure for sure like you know that song by j cole that uh, good news is you went a long way the bad news is you went the wrong way yeah that was basically me like i felt that i was just going not even i felt i realized that i was going the completely wrong way and that's because i didn't really have the confidence in myself to go after the things that i wanted i didn't really have the confidence to you know pursue the life that i wanted to live i was just you know i was just scared guys i was really just scared but then i realized that you know what i'm that girl like <laughs> i'm that girl and it took some time before i even realized all of these things hence why i decided to just make a video about it because hopefully someone out there who is also just you know floating they don't know if they're coming or they're going they don't really believe in themselves they don't really have self-acceptance they're just you know down bad like i was at some point in time i hope that whoever sees that video finally gets that that knock in the head the same knock in the head that i got to actually start you know taking action and start moving towards my dream reality and for me to improve my self-love there are a couple of things that i did so i'm obviously going to be sharing the things that really helped me and the things that really like i would say really like stood out in my journey of you know more self-love and more self-acceptance the first thing is guys like i honestly stopped talking down on myself like i've always known that it's very bad to talk down on yourself like the last thing you want to be is your own hater like because subconsciously your mind doesn't know what's true and what's not so if you're going to be your own hater and you're gonna be like oh i'm a failure oh i suck oh i can't do this and this like subconsciously your mind will truly believe that you really can't do those things <laughs> even though it's not true 
even though it's definitely not true but subconsciously like your mind doesn't know the difference between what's true and what's not so you are going to start believing those things and when you start believing those things best believe that will be your reality <laughs> that will be your reality and that's not what you want you don't want to hate on yourself so bad that you yourself are the one that's holding yourself back and secondly, don't allow people in your life that don't treat you the way that you feel you deserve to be treated. You know, there's that movie with that famous saying that, you know, you only accept the love that you think you deserve. It's so true, guys. Like, anyone who doesn't treat you the way that you want to be treated definitely does not deserve a place in your life. Because the longer that you accept low vibrational things low vibrational people low self-worth activities the more you will subconsciously believe that's all that you deserve so if you are accepting those 2 a.m texts of are you up are you up nobody's ever planning a date with you or your friends are only texting you when they need something or jay you're just never anybody's first choice like if you're always accepting those kind of things best believe over time right you will really start to believe that's all you deserve and think it for me like i'm always someone who's had like i've had a sense of self-worth like it hasn't always been like very stable as it is now but i've always had you know that sense of self-worth but this thing of like you know accepting things and accepting people in my life who are not treating me the way that i deserve to be treated actually altered my self-worth because over time guys over time like if you're consistently accepting low vibrational things trust me eventually you're gonna start believing that's all that you deserve but looking back i'm just like oh my goodness like why did i not know <laughs> why did i not know that's why i'm telling you guys so that you hopefully know and that you can learn from my mistakes and the third thing that i started doing that really helped with my self-love is that i stopped seeking validation from other people and by other people i don't just mean like just anybody i even mean like even the closest people to you because thing is people come and go right like people will come into your life some people will leave your life not necessarily by choice you know like there's a lot of things that happen life is very unpredictable guys but one thing for certain is that the one person that you'll always have always forever ever 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 in your whole entire life will be yourself like you are the one thing that will always be consistent in your life like for sure no matter what happens even if the world is ending like you are always going to have yourself so the best validation is self validation the best stuff is self stuff like you need to you need to rate yourself guys like you really need to rate yourself like don't let any don't let any like criticism also get to your head whether it's like good criticism bad criticism no like all the validation that you get should come from yourself because that way nobody can ever take it away from you because it comes from within guys don't ever place a value in how you look like don't ever place a value in how you look like i know i'm pretty not because i look pretty but because of my energy like beauty is energy and when you have the right energy just know you will be radiating beauty you know that audio by Saweetie, that one that was on TikTok, that one, I'm a pretty bitch, you know, I'm pretty in my mindset, I'm pretty in the way that I carry myself. Yeah, like, it's actually a real thing, like, you will be stunning, and all of that beauty will come from how you carry yourself, how you see yourself, you know, the energy that you radiate, the vibes that you give out, like, all of that counts beauty truly is energy it really has nothing to do with physicality at all that's why you even find some people who maybe they're not like your idea of like beauty but then there's just something about them guys like there's just something about them where you're like mm, mm. you know because beauty is energy guys and it's very important to have the right energy so with all of that being said guys, I really hope that you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up and subscribe if you're not subscribed yet. Until next time, this is it from The Consistent Queen. Bye!